Hi everyone, this is Manra Krishna. So today video we are going to learn about the how to insert the equations in draw data. So draw data use mostly used for the flowchart design and uh, we'll have the different types of drawings. Okay, we can do. Okay, so this will be most useful for the for drawing the different diagrams all the thing. So let's check the what are the diagrams we can have. So here we can see. So we'll have in the class diagram, flow chart, organization chart, single line diagram, and identity relation diagram. Okay, Canvas diagram, cross functional flow chart, placeholder, mind map, sequence diagram. Okay, so different uh, diagrams are there as well as we having the uh, so whatever the things are basics. Okay, charts, cloud. Okay, cloud based. So how it will be like? Okay, so this diagram also we can draw. And if you take the engineering related, okay, circuits also we can draw. So next to flow charts, we have the different types of flow charts here, and the maps. So mind maps we can have. So networks, so computer related, and other things we'll have in the here we can see, and the software related we can see here, and the tables we can show. These are diagrams, Venn diagrams, okay next to wireframes as you know the layouts okay so these are the so let's take the black diagram okay so here if you want to uh, insert the equation okay so major thing is that uh, while drawing the diagrams uh, sometimes we require the writing the equation okay but writing the equations so it will be different so suppose if we take the uh, here in the rectangle so if you want to place the equations in that one so so, uh, so let, uh, for that one we require okay so here if you want to place the equations okay so here how to write the equations okay first we'll before that uh, how to write the suffix and okay so suppose if you talk about uh, n power okay so we'll have in the formula that a plus b Okay, a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab. Okay, suppose these diagrams. So, for this equations, if you want to place here, the, this one. So, this is the one. So, for smaller equations, we can write. Okay, so this is the one equation so suppose if you want to place the any symbol here okay so this is the how the power symbol okay now suffix six how we place okay so there is suppose if it is n related okay n factor is there so n so if you want to place n two so this is also we can place there to place nth it will be common okay so if you want to write the in the way so nth here below water so that's also comes in so to place that and select the letters hand here so we need to subscript or suppress so that we need to select okay this is one thing and another thing that so different so suppose if you're having the um, fractional formulas, okay? For the fractional formulas, we need to write the fractional formulas. So first, in the latex, we need to write. So suppose this is uh, equation, so we need to place the dollar symbol in between the equation, okay, so it does it, 
So we need to check your extras map rotation. Okay. So we need to enable this, go to the extra and enable the map. So if you remove this one, it will refresh. So go to the extra and if you type setting, if you turn off, it will refresh. Okay. So these will be useful for the control system diagrams while you drawing. Okay. This way. So similarly, you can uh, make the uh, different uh, formulas insertion here. Okay. So here there's the examples you can see here the, in the chart. So this way. Okay. So how will be written? So you need to check here. So the equations are there, the examples in their page. Okay. Try to go through the examples. Okay. Anyhow. Have a nice day. Thank you.